All right, so I just wrapped my peach slices in some crescents, and now we are gonna bring in a 13 by nine, and we are gonna place our crescents right in our pan, lined up so perfectly. All right. I just made another batch of these peaches wrapped in crescent dough. So we used two packages total. All right, now that these are ready, we're gonna head to the stove. All right, we're starting off with two sticks of butter, a half a cup of brown sugar, and then a splash of vanilla extract. I'm just gonna use all that. It's pretty much done, though. Okay, and we are just gonna let that melt and become a super delicious and flavorful little mixture that's gonna go so beautifully with those peaches. Oh my goodness, you guys are really gonna love this one. It's so easy and so tasty. Did you put this on medium heat, medium high heat? Or this is on off? medium high. All right, this is ready. Let's go ahead and bring it over to our peaches. All right, and we're just gonna pour this mixture right on top of these delicious peaches and crescents. That looks so delicious. Oh yeah, and we're not ready yet. Okay, this is the secret ingredient. You cannot skip it. A can of Mountain Dew. I know Ooh. it sounds crazy, but it's incredible. And we're just gonna pour that right with it. One whole can. And you guys will see how delicious this comes out. My oven is set to 350 and this is gonna bake for about 35 minutes. Oh my. This smells incredible, you guys. Oh, ho, ho. looks amazing. Okay, let's go ahead and oh yeah, that's gonna be so good. I can't even smell the Mountain Dew. I all I can smell is peaches and sugar and deliciousness. barely see it. Yeah, there it is. <laughs> mm. Is it good? That is outstanding. Mm. 